kind of interesting. This is a dry cleaning shop. Um, it actually still has, you know, all the equipment and stuff in it. Um, you know, it it had a minimum bid of 11000 uh, ended up selling for 30000 You know, it has an assessed value of about 78000 and I'm guessing, in, you know, in market value that's going to be over 100000 You know, really, the, the way you would judge this property as far as its real value, and if, if we were to buy this property, what we would probably do is completely clean it out. And there might be some value in the, the stuff that's left. What we'd have to do with any of that personal items is we'd need to go ahead and send out a certified letter to the past owner, giving them a time frame. Uh, many times it could be between 14 to 30 days to have the, the uh, stuff cleared, set up a time with you to, to open it up to them. Uh, and then at that point, if they didn't, then you're free to get rid of it. But really, this would be a great property to redo into office space or into retail location or something like mm -hmm. that. And then yeah, make it more flexible. Get a tenant, mm -hmm. and then sell it as an investment property. You know, then if it's if, if this rent is renting out for twenty five hundred, or let's say you do offices renting, you know, for three grand a month, uh, you know, that's going to be a lot more than a hundred thousand dollars in in value when you go to resell it. Yeah, yeah, it's true. It's a way that you could really you know increase your uh, your investment on this.